welcome back with another video. Today I've got a friend from Taiwan who's going to help us learn about the Lunar New Year. Hi everyone, I'm Billy John from Xinzhou, Taiwan, and uh, I'm really glad to share the things that we know. Okay, let's get started. We're going to teach you five facts about Lunar New Year. The Lunar New Year celebrates the beginning of the spring season and the end of winter. For that reason, it can also be called Spring Festival, which in Mandarin is Chunjie. This is the character for spring, Chun. This year, the Lunar New Year's Eve is on Thursday, February 11th, and the Lunar New Year celebration lasts from Lunar New Year's Eve for 15 days onward and ends with the Lantern Festival. Hey guys, uh, the second thing about the Lunar New Year is the, uh, this year is the year of Ox. Ox in Chinese character is Neo right over here. And in different years that in Chinese zodiac rep represents different animals. So from snake, mouse, dragon. So uh, check what kind of animal you are. So for those who are born in this year, you are just like ox. You are strong and honest. The third thing is Tuan Yuan, fun. During New Year's Eve, um, Taiwanese people like to celebrate the same way that we might for Christmas, celebrating and eating food and spending time with their entire family over multiple generations. Um, they like to sit at round tables and they always eat fish because the word for fish in Mandarin sounds like the word for surplus. It's yi. So they say nian nian yo yi because it sounds like to have surplus every year. Hi guys, the fourth thing about the Lunar New Year you have to know is putting up red carpets. Tie chun lian. And this is how we do uh, to do the New Year decoration. We put this chun lian right over here. And the meaning of this is to keep the evil away and pray for blessing. Especially for this one, this one here right over here in Mandarin, this is fu, and it means fortune. And we usually put this decoration upside down. So it means fu dao. It means that fortune has come to us right over here. So uh, you should put this in your house. Number five is Hong Bao. This is red envelopes. Uh, traditionally, older people will give young adults and children red envelopes full of money after the Tuan Yuan Fan. This is supposed to bring good luck, prosperity, health, uh, good studies for the next year. And because children and young adults are looking forward to receiving the red envelopes, there is a saying that is Gong Shi Fa Tsai Hong Bao Na Lai, which means Congratulations, Happy New Year, now give me my red envelope. Thanks everyone for watching. Now you know five important facts about Lunar New Year. And we wish you a Happy, Happy New Year. Gong Shi Fa Tsai Hong Bao Na Lai.